Hello and welcome to Only Connect, the quiz that's more reliant on connections than my career. Two new teams in contention tonight, and they are... On my right, Daniel Nazarian, a chartered accountant and keen crossworder with a passion for Persian cuisine. Anna Kirby Hall, a theology student and grandmother of three who has seen every Shakespeare play except two. And their captain, Elliot Costi, a software engineer and music fan who can't ride a bike. Daniel collects number one singles of the 1990s. Elliot has 6,000 CDs arranged alphabetically and Anna owns over 100 owl figurines. They are the collectors. What sort of thing, these 6,000 CDs, what are they mainly? It's mostly dance music, house trance, drum and bass. Um, there's some, I collect like world music as well, that sort of stuff. Yeah. Just exactly what my own record collection <laughs> is not. <laughs> you are facing tonight on my left, David Smith, a retired computer analyst who hails from Dublin and is the proud owner of two retired greyhounds. Sri Kantamnani, a management consultant and keen chess player who enjoys travelling to historic places, preferably by train, and their captain, Bob Thompson, a former printer who collects pocket watches and celebrated his 60th birthday by driving a tram. United by an interest in railways, they are the railwaymen. What do you like about trains? Well, I'm more interested in the social history and the changes brought about by the railways and tramways. When it was your birthday, you chose yeah. to drive a tram rather than a train. Did you manage not to crash it? Yeah, well, the steering's quite difficult, actually. The steering may or may not be difficult on tonight's quiz. Let's find out by playing round one. You will be going first at Railwoman because you won the toss. I simply want to know what is the connection between four apparently random clues. The fewer clues you see before giving me the right answer, the more points you get. Please choose an Egyptian hieroglyph. Two reads, please. Two reads. What is the connection between these clues? They are going to be pictures, picture clues at the beginning. What links them? Here's the first. Yeah. Next. White suit. White suit. Yeah. yeah. Go for it. Yeah. White suit. It's as simple as that. These are all men well known for wearing white suits. We're looking at Elvis Presley and Paul Sinner. Alec Guinness would have been third. And last, Martin Bell. Why Alec Guinness? He was in The Man in the White Suit. Simple as that, the film The Man in the White Suit. Distinctive white suit wearers. Three points to you, because you came in after two clues. Over to you collectors to choose a question. Eye of Horus, please. Eye of Horus. What is the connection between these clues? Here's the first. It's, a, it's an internet domain. Mm -hmm. yeah, let's go to the next one, Next, please. Perhaps not. We have to do that one, won't we? Yeah. Next, please. Oh, dear. Oh, the beginning of... Oh, well, you can put stuff on the end of yeah. them, do you think? Oh, Next, please. Off, off quite as it's... it's oh, so it yes. is. They're all regu regulatory bodies with the off taken off the beginning. That's exactly right. If you had an off at the beginning, you get UK regulators. Ofcom, Ofchem, Ofqual, Ofsted. What can you tell me about what they do? Ofsted is, is for schools. Mm -hmm. Ofcom is for uh, communications. Yes. Broadcasting, postal yeah. regulation, that sort of thing. Ofqual um, is qualification bodies. Yes, an exam regulation. Yeah. And what about Ofgem? That's it's um, energy utilities. Energy utilities. utilities. OK, yeah. yeah. Well done. That is a point to you. Back to you, Railwomen, for a choice. Water, please. The water question. What is the connection between these clues? Here's the first. What does he say? Charade, isn't it? Oh, yeah. OK, should we go for a second one? Yeah. Next. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Um, these are actions that you make when playing charades. Wow, very quick off the press with that. Another three points to you, very well done. Let's look at all the clues. Can you talk me through them and I'd like to see the actions as you explain? Uh, sounds like. That's the last one. The. Yeah. And that's a book. 
That's right, unfolding your palms to mean a um, book. Pointing to your eye. It's I, to indicate I, the first person. I, 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 means I, yeah. I have a dream, something like that. Clues when playing charades. Very well done. Charades fans, are you? No. Really? How come you know it? Well, I've played it, but you don't have to be a fan when you get roped into these party games, do you, I suppose? That's the spirit. <laughs> Happy Christmas to you. <laughs> Back to you collectors to choose a question. Twisted facts, please. The twisted facts, why not? Ah, it's the music question. You will be hearing the clues. Something links them. What is it? Here's the first. Oh, this is Sandra Gennaro, isn't it? Yeah. 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 Next, please. That's the Renault Girls and I'll be I'd rather Jack. Mm ish. Jack, Samba. Do you reckon it's all dances? To you next. Next, please. The pass. Oh my god. Three seconds. Nominate Anna. Um, are they, were they all originally performed by somebody else and then had somebody put on them? I'm afraid that is not the right answer, so I'm going to have to play a little blast to the fourth clue to the Rail Women for a possible bonus point. I think that'll probably do. Have you got an answer? No, you don't know it. Now, I'm interested because you were saying some very knowledgeable things over there about what we were hearing. Tell me which artists we heard from. Bellini was the mm -hmm. first one. Yep. It was the Reynolds Girls. Yep. Then it was... What was the third one again? Turner. Turner. Oh. It was Tina Turner. Turner and, and Rembrandt. Rembrandt. Yeah. They're all painters. painters. That's right, they share their names with painters. Bellini, Reynolds, Turner, Rembrandt, painters. <laughs> you know it now, but unfortunately too late. Oh, well. Oh, well. No bonus point then, Railwayman, but you do get your own question. Which would you like? Uh, lion, please. Lion. What connects these clues? Here's the first. Well, I think it'll be for all club. Yeah. Next. Does that mean anything to you? That doesn't make sense. Try another one. Next. Yes, 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 yeah. Scarlet. Is the right answer. I'll show you the last clue. What can you tell me about them? Um, Sherlock Holmes studying Scarlet. Mm -hmm. it's, a Percy, it's a Percy Blakeney, Scarlet Pimpernel. Yep. Lanethley, I should have remembered, are the Scarlets. The rugby union team yeah. is nicknamed the Scarlets. Uh, a for adultery. I, I wouldn't know anything about that. The Scarlet that. woman had to put an A up. Now, that's right, it's from <laughs> the, the Scarlet Letter. Hester mm. had to wear a Scarlet A to indicate adultery. Very well done. Last question of the round then goes to you, collectors. It will be the Horned Viper. What is the connection between these clues? Here's the first. Is that you, Isborn? Yeah. Didn't even know. Next, please. No. <laughs> I don't know what that is. Washington, my dear. Do you know what that is? No. Next, please. Next, please. So, so it's Lucy the Sky Diamonds. Yeah. So they're, they're presidents and Beatles songs. That's so what it is. So in, in the Roosevelt. Roosevelt. Three seconds. Okay. Nominate Dan. They are Beatles singles in the year they were released, uh, which share the names with the spouses of American presidents. That's exactly what it is. Well done, because it's a real intricate one. So, Michelle, the Beatles song, we've put Obama from Michelle Obama. Martha, my dear, Martha Washington. Eleanor Roosevelt for Eleanor Rigby. And Hayes in the Sky with Diamonds. Yes, Lucy Hayes, the wife of rather lame duck 19th century president, Rutherford B. Hayes. So, at the end of round one, the collectors have two points, the rail women have eight. <laughs> In round two, there will still be four clues, but the last one is hidden because I want to know what it is. It's the sequences round. Teams miss here a maximum of three before telling me what comes next. Relman, you'll be going first again, so please choose an Egyptian hieroglyph. Two reads, please. Two reads. OK, I'd like to know what you think would come fourth in this sequence. Here's the first. Specific. 
Next. Next. Two testaments is a perfect answer. And why is that? Um, it's breakdown of the Bible. That's exactly right. Two testaments broken up into 66 books, broken into 1,189 chapters and then 31,102 verses. It's the King James Bible. Well done. Back to you collectors for a choice. Twisted flax, please. The twisted flax. OK, what would come forth in this sequence? Here's the first. I don't know what that is. No, could be two names put together, maybe. Okay. Next, please. Oh, are they makers of guns? Are they all makers of guns? So what the last one you could have Samuel Colt. Should we risk it? Okay. We're behind, well, should we risk it? One. No, what would be the sequence? Oh. So, you've got, um... Uh, what is the sequence? It's the, 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 the rifle maker, Smith and... I think we should go. Okay. Okay. Don't think no. Okay. Samuel Colt. Not the answer, I'm afraid. So I'm going to show the third and a sequence to the railwoman for a possible bonus point. I have no idea. Nope. Nope. You no don't idea, know. I can tell you that the connection is these are all chief scouts, chief scouts oh, of the Bear scouting Grylls. association. I can hear you muttering it now. After Peter Duncan, Bear Grylls would be the next chief scout. So, no bonus point, Railwomen, but let's see what you can do with your next question. Which would you like? David? Eye of Horus, please. The Eye of Horus. These are going to be picture clues. What would you expect to see in the fourth picture? Here's the first. <laughs> next. That's Derek Jeter. Derek Jeter. He's just retired. Could be, could be any. Sure, no one. Yeah. 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 Next. X ray, just X ray. Just. Just X ray. Oops. Oh, cheater. Three seconds. Yes. Um, nicknames for groups of people. I'd like to know what comes forth in the sequence. Oh, of course, yeah. Mm. In that case... You don't know. I have know. no idea. Fair enough. Bonus chance for you collectors. Is it a glass of whiskey? As is so often the case, <laughs> the right answer to this problem is a glass of whiskey. Very well done. And why? It's the phonetic alphabet going backwards. That's right. What are we looking at? Um, Zulu, Yankee and X-Ray. Very well done. So, a bonus point for you collectors and your choice. Horned Viper, please. Horned Viper. What would come forth in this sequence? Here's the first. I don't know what that is. The new football team or something. I don't know. Next, please. That's the German football team. Oh, they're not the German football teams in Alfred Lord, are they? No, but the first one's probably a Dutch team, and it could be Alfred Lord, though. So, we can have one begins with D. Who won this one? Should we go for it? Should we go for next? Should we go for next? Yeah. Or is it going to be. Yeah, go for next. Next, one. please. No, okay, it's not. Oh, they're managed by Louis van der Gaal, so maybe it's uh, Manchester United. Should we do that? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Is it Manchester United? It is Manchester well United. Okay. Daniel, I suspect you got that one. Well, why is it Manchester United? Uh, I believe they're all managed by. Uh, I don't know how to pronounce his name. Louis van der Gaal or Louis van der Gaal? I mean, that's much better yeah. pronunciation than I'd have managed. Yes, sir. Van Gaal, Van Gaal. I'm not a big Dutch speaker. But, yes, they are football teams, and you're right, that is a Dutch club, then a German club, and then the country, the Netherlands, and he moved on to Manchester United. That was next. Well done. And back to you, Railwoman, for the last choice of the round. Um, lion, please. Lion. What would come forth in this sequence? Here's the first. Next. Yeah, watch the fourth. Oh, 
Next. No. Haven't got one, so a bonus right. chance again for you collectors. No nominate Dan. Oh dear. Spit uh, something out, Dan. An FA Cup final. I mean, that would be a fabulous answer, and it's close. Iraq airstrikes. <laughs> <laughs> now, this, as I think you know over there, that's right, the sequence is reasons that UK Parliament has been recalled. Oh. And we're going forwards in time towards the most recent time, at a time of recording the discussion of airstrikes against Iraq in September 2014 against the so-called Islamic State. Before that, it was when President Assad had used chemical weapons in Syria. Before that, the death of Lady Thatcher. Parliament was recalled to pay tribute. And before that, the riots that spread out from London. They are recalls of the UK Parliament. And next was Iraq airstrikes. So no bonus points, but you get the last question of the round. No choice, it must be water. What would be the fourth in this sequence? Here's the first. Ditto. Uh, Ditto. It's a quotation mark. Instead of saying I love you. <laughs> next, to next, please. Rhenium, that's a chemical element. Simple as R H. Okay. Oh, it's, it's, it's just that, it's, isn't it's, it? It's two little speech yeah. marks under um, the word. Next, please. Michigan. Oh, my God, to spell out the word. Hello. Yes. RA, please. Not the no. answer, I'm afraid. So, a bonus chance for you now, Railwoman. What might come forth? Far. I'm going to accept it. Looking at the other clues, mm -hmm. I'd love to hear something. Do, re, mi, fa. Yes, I mean, for example, the Football Association or. Oh, FA, yeah. Sweet no. Fanny Adams, something like that. But it's FA. So, we're looking at do, re, mi, M I for Michigan. So, I want to hear FA or far. For example, the Football Association representing do, re, mi, fa. It's notes. Notes on a scale. So, well done. You get the bonus point, Railwoman. And that means at the end of round two, the collectors have five points. The Railwoman have 11. <laughs> it's our notorious connecting wall now. 16 jumbled up clues that need to be sorted into four connected groups of four. There are red herrings on the wall that fit into more than one category, but only one Perfect solution. You'll be going first this time, collectors. First question is, would you like lion or water? Water, please. OK, you have two and a half minutes to solve the water wall, starting now. It's Genesis. Genesis oh. Birth as well. Uh, yeah, Fountain. There's fount as well. Fountain, yeah. Things being... What's the first one? Dawn. Yeah, okay. so, dawn. So, dawn, birth, genesis. Fount. Sorry, I didn't see it. Okay. Miss that genesis. Miss that birth. Yay. Okay. Right. So. Tractor, sector, barber. Oh. Sector, tractor, barber. Oops. Plotter. Belter. Question Belter. Question Question all. Question all is better. Okay. What are we going with? Barb. Barb, Barb sorry. Uh, miss out tract. Miss out sect. Did we get all of them? This is plotter as well. Mm. Trader? No, I don't know. Not whether they are. Okay. Fruit. Tract, plot, uh, writing, question is writing. Anything else? Um, parcel. Stretch marks, track marks? Uh huh. Yes. Question marks. Question marks, birth marks. Yeah. Is there a fifth one? Uh, marks. Water, water marks. Water marks. Uh, miss out question. Miss out stretch. Miss out birth. Miss out tract. Did, did not do that one. <gasps> oh dear. Parcel, Parcel route, trade route. You've got 30 seconds. Oh dear. Oh, birth canal, water canal. 
Trade me? Uh, trade. No. So four. Ten seconds. Yeah. Is it a word one? It's got the arc in it. It's no. No. Really. Yeah, they are, mate. I'm afraid you're out, out of time. Out of time. Yeah. Yeah. But you found a group, so that's <laughs> an immediate point. And I'll give you another one if you can tell me the connection. Genesis, seed, dawn, fount. They're all beginnings or, or the starting of something. That's right, they all mean beginnings. And you can still get points for the connections in the groups you didn't find, so let's resolve the wall. There you go, that's how it should have looked. So the green group, question, water, birth, trade. They're all marks. Those are the marks. Oh, now, you were saying trade. tract mark. I'm not quite familiar with that, but trade yeah. mark. Question mark, water mark, birth mark. And the next group, stretch, plot, parcel, belt. It's not like green. a piece of land. Green. 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 They're all no, no, pieces of land. They're pieces of land, land aren't they? Yeah. Piece... Yeah. That's right, they're yeah. all pieces of land. Uh, tract would be the red herring for that. So a stretch of land, a plot of land, parcel of land or a belt. And what about the last light blue group? Barb, fruit, sect, tract. Can they all end er? Uh? It is to do with the words. What you can put on the end is arian. Barbarian, fruitarian, sectarian, uh. tractarian. But a point for the group that you found and three for the connections, that is a total of four. Time to bring back the railwomen, give them a new connecting wall. 16 new jumbled up clues still need sorting via the same methods. It's going to be the lion wall for you, railwomen, because the water's been taken. You have two and a half minutes to solve it, starting now. What's the Lawmakers, yeah, go on, Sri. So, Moses, Los, Justinian. Yeah. Right now. Um, Hammurabi. Hammurabi, Draco, Solomon, Moses. He's a, he's a, a Syrian. Um, I can see three comedians there. You've got Brightall, Mobrian, Bishop, Jalili. Jalili. Any other comedians on there? Let's. Spot anything else you carry on? Glue and a glug are obviously drinks. Go for, your, go for your lawmakers again. Uh, um, Justinian's a lawmaker, yeah. We've not done all these. Bishop, white or open green. Draco's also got an uh, alternative for dragon. You've got a minute left. It's got to be another comedian, yeah. That's right. Yeah. That's right. It's right. Jalili, Lily, no. O'Brien, they've got to be the comedians. Is there something called Prado? Um, there, there wasn't. Uh, Draco, Jalili, Whitehall. Oh! Go for your. Yeah, three strikes stuff, and great you're great out stuff. now. Ooh. 30 seconds. Bishop. Bishop and brother. Religious titles. No. Negus. What's Negus? Negus. Uh, There's a clog something. The blue eyes. We've got, got a. a, a, a the blue one must go with clog. Yeah. But we have a drink there. Got one more go and, and 10 seconds. Word connection. Um, blast off. Big, no, hang on. Big, big blast, big brother. No. Two seconds. Two that's it, you're out of time. No, but you found two groups, so that's two points, and I'll give you more points for the connections. First group, O'Brien, Solon, Jalili, Whitehall. Stand-up comedians. They are comedians. Dar O'Brien, Laura Solon, that you kept putting in a different group, Omid Jalili and Jack Whitehall. They're all comedians. What about the next green group starting Justinian? Three. Lomikos. They are the ancient lawmakers. Quite right, so long was the red herring for that group. You can still get points for the connections in the groups you didn't find, so let's resolve the wall. There you go. Now, what about the pink group starting Negus? Negus is mulled wine, isn't it? Mulled wine. 
They are mulled drinks. That's absolutely right. Negus, Glurg, Luvine and Bishop. They are all mulled drinks. And the last one, Rats Blast Dam Brother. Oh. Are they all uh, are um, things that you say in comics, in yeah, comic bubbles? Yeah, they, they are mild swear words. Comic bubbles, yeah. I'll take mild swear words, yeah. exclamations of annoyance. Yeah. So that is two points for the groups you found and four for the connections. That's a total of six. Let's have a look at the scores going into round four. The collectors have nine points, the railwomen have 17. So a bit of work for you to do in round four, collectors, but it is possible because in this round, teams lose points if they get anything wrong, as well as gaining points if they get anything right. It's the missing vowels round. We've taken well-known names, phrases and sayings, taken out the vowels, squidged up the consonants, and I want to know, what are the disguised clues? So fingers on buzzers, teams. I will tell you that the first group are all ways to descend a mountain. Rowerman. Cable car. Correct. Rowerman. Abseil. Correct. Rowerman. Slalom ski. That's right. Don't know this one. It's Scree Run. Next category, famous people who lived together. A tough one, this. It's Michael Caine and Terence Stamp. Collectors. Ben Affleck and Matt Damon. Correct. No, it's roommates at Harvard, Tommy Lee Jones and Al Gore. Next clue. Rowerman. Anton Deck. Correct. Next category, things that might contain insects. Rowerman. Ant Hill. Correct. Rowerman. Hornet's Nest. Correct. No need to give me the last answer, which would have been flea pit, because that is the end of the quiz. Looking at the final scores then, with 23 points winning and through to the next round are the Railwomen. A noble second place with 10 points, it's the Collectors. Unlucky Collectors, but you don't go out, you'll have another chance to win through to the next round later in the series. Railwomen, you are through, very well done to you. Thank you for watching. And if you'd like to take issue with anything in tonight's show, then take my advice, don't bother writing in. It'll only get lost amid all the crates of the question editor's returned Valentine's cards. But if you're partial to a box of past its sell-by date milk tray stamped not known at this address, then do pop by. We've got stacks of them. Goodbye. <laughs>